it looks like that Bitcoin is ready to get your continuation to the upside. And I'm going to show you the signs that I see right now in the market that are exactly pointing to this scenario playing out over the next two days. So if you think that is interesting, then definitely stick around here. Um, subscribe to the channel, like this video and also activate the bell so that you will never miss out on these important updates and when I put them out. And now let's directly go here into the charts. So when we go here to the daily chart for Bitcoin, first of all, I want to point out here again that we see here um, in inverse head and shoulders playing out where, where we have here the left side, here we have the head and here we have the right side of the shoulder and the neckline is already broken. Let me zoom in here a little bit. So we have two days, uh, Yesterday, we have successfully broken above the neckline here. And today we see a potential retest of that neckline, which is a healthy sign. We want to see a retest because then we know within the next couple of candles, we will see the lift off to the upside. So now when we have a look here again at the technical target for this inverse head and shoulders pattern, like I said here, left shoulder, the head and the right shoulder until here. So then we measure the target from the bottom to the top all the way down approximately here. And I had mentioned that before. So you see the technical target is all the way up here at $35,000, which is absolutely insane if we would reach that target. So, but a Bitcoin is struggling for the next two days with a bigger problem. So, and I also wanna to get to that here really quickly. And that is the 200 weekly moving average that is holding us down right now. So Bitcoin is really trying to break above the 200 um, weekly moving average here so that we can move into higher levels. Because if I draw here now a line and you will see it, that this is exactly the level where we get held down there at 24,600. No, actually I have to make it higher here. There, 25,272 is the level that is holding us down here right now. We have to break above that. So, and then once we break above that, there is nothing stopping Bitcoin to go here to around $29,000. So, and that is what I'm betting on right now that we see a weekly bullish candle close with continuation to the upside for Bitcoin here. And why do I believe that um, to be happening? So when I go to the daily chart, I can see here the MACD has now flashed bullish uh, here with the green candles down here. And also the MACD oscillator uh, has flipped bullish. We are getting here also a buy signal because the blue line is getting over the uh, red line. And then also the RSI is in a position where we normally see continuation to the upside. So we have here a lot of bullish indications for another impulse move to the upside that, and that could look something like, let me see, uh, where do I have it here again? So this could look something like here, here it is. something like this. So potentially, um, so that uh, something like this I'm looking at here. So with a nice breakout, a successful breakout over $26,000 with a retest of 25,272 to confirm this as support and then continuation to the upside. And that is the play that we could be looking at in the next couple of days. So would I get now based on that in a long position. No, I wouldn't. So, um, because we are kind of in no man's land. So let me show you why. So here on the four hourly chart, uh, we are still in um, a broadening wedge here. So, and here again, we can also see clear resistance here on the upper side, everywhere here. So, and we see also support on the lower side 
The only thing what I would potentially do here, and that is really risky, would be if we get here again to the top today or tomorrow, uh, potentially short this all the way to the bottom, potentially, but I uh, would be not confident that we reach the bottom because we see here within this broadening wedge already that we have here some sort of a so supportive bottom um, formed at around $23,400. So I would only scalp this potentially all the way down there. But my first target, if I would be shorting this, would be here. So because there is another support forming right now at $24,550. So we have a $1,000 spread. If you want to try to short this here from um, the resistance again to the support, if you do that with one Bitcoin and you do it with 20X, so then you can make $20,000 here um, if that scenario would be playing out. So, but I would actually hedge that. I would open a short and a long position. And um, if the if I see the long playing out and we break here above that resistance, then everything is fine uh, and we close the short. So if the short is playing out, then the long is potentially in a small loss, but I still believe that the long can recover and that we then go to the upside. So the only question is, Will we see a direct breakout when we come back up here and go a step through this? Or will we see just one more retest and then go to the upside? So that is the only question that we should asking right now, because one of the two is uh, what's going to happen here. And in the next um, 36 hours, we are gonna know when the weekly close is happening, I reckon that this weekly close will be a highly volatile one as we have seen it for quite some time, not in the market. So I remember weekly closes where the price um, was just pumping and pumping and pumping um, when we got into the last, let's say 10 minutes. And sometimes the price was jumping a thousand dollars in these last 10 minutes. So a weekly close like that could be something that we are looking at for this weekend. So also when we look at the super guppy here, we're still in an uptrend. So that is also, of course, um, a good indication of that we remain in this uptrend for now because we have just flipped uh, two days, uh, three days ago back into this uptrend. And since then we remain above the uh, super guppy indicator. And guys, of course, don't forget, if you want to trade with me together, then do this on Bybit. It's the best exchange out there uh, with that specific um, sign up link um, or you use a bit get there you still get twenty thousand dollars also only with that specific link here the links are in the description below and in the pin comment below and if you have seen yesterday's video you know that we are highly up on all the altcoins that i have recommended only yesterday so um if you want to trade all these calls with me together do this on a buy bit so now when we go back here uh to this um to this daily chart. So then we can also see that a Bitcoin has formed around here, this level. 23,400, also some sort of a support. And here was another technical target that I wanted to show you guys before I'm leaving. So here you see also here on the Fibonacci extension levels, we are right now trying to break above the 1.236 and after that the golden ratio is at around $26,000 and then the 2.618 is all the way up here at 29,149, 29,328 in that kind of area. So once we are breaking here above the 1.236 because you see that is also where more or less the resistance is lying right now. We will see a massive, massive major move here for Bitcoin. So definitely get ready for that. Guys, that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Um, let me know in the, in the comments if you also think that we're going to see here some fireworks um, in the next two days for Bitcoin. And uh, if you have uh, uh, taken some positions here let me know i would like to know uh, and don't forget smash up the like button hit the subscribe button hit the notification bell and you'll see you then again tomorrow